trouble drinking the water and I know I need to drink more. And sometimes I really like try to push myself. So what I what I started to do at work, um, when, I, when I just started WW, I used to have like a gallon bottle of water and I would put like crystallite in there and I would try to finish that bottle of water that day. So each day I tried to drink at least a gallon and then I would write on there like specific times I had to reach a certain, I had to drink a certain amount. And then I just stopped, you know, I was doing so good at it. I was doing really good at it and then I stopped. So now I started to do it again. The only difference is I don't have crystal light in the water. Um, I just have a little um, lemon, lemon juice in the water. And then I still don't drink, end up drinking the whole bottle, but at least half of the bottle. So I think that's still a plus compared to not drinking any water at all. Um, and then I have, my friends told me about using like fruits to um, like infuse the water or whatever, or however you say it. I haven't tried, I, I think I tried it like once, but I haven't really, it's not something that I really do. Cause I think I just, the fruits, I waste the fruits that way, I'd rather eat it. So I don't really, um, I don't do that. But if anybody have any suggestions or advice for me, please, 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 please. Just leave it in the comment section. Um, I've been struggling with my weight for years. There was one point where after I had my son, I lost a lot of weight. After I had my um, last son, I lost a lot of weight. And it felt really good. And I came here and I gained so much. And ever since I gained it, I haven't been able to lose it. But during like going to school and everything, I was not comfortable in my skin at all. And I didn't feel good. I didn't feel good about myself. My self-esteem was very low. Um, and then when I became an adult, it was bad and not too bad. Because, you know, I was an adult then, so I didn't really care what people thought at that time. That was their business, I don't care. It hurt me more when I was in school. But when I became an adult, I felt, you know, I was more confident about myself because like I said, I didn't care what people thought. But I always wanted to, you know, lose enough weight and feel, be at the point where I feel like, yeah, this is me, this is where I wanna be. And not worry about you know, putting something on and be like, oh, I can't fit this, I can't fit that, you know. And that's why I started, I started on this journey and tried to, you know, get, change my life. Because a lot of things that I really wanted to wear, I couldn't wear anymore. And on top of that, my kids was like, mom, you, you're getting old, what, what happened to all the clothes you used to wear? You know, the way you used to dress, I used to like it. Well, your mama can't dress that way because she can't fit in those things anymore that she used to wear. So I had to make a change. I had to make up my mind and make a change. And that's what I did. And I decided, you know, back in March, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna try. And failure, that word is not gonna be in my vocabulary. It's not gonna be in my book. It's not something that's gonna happen. So I decided, you know, I'm gonna do it. And it's been a, <laughs> it's been a rough road because it's up, it's down, it's up, it's down. I want to quit sometimes. I just want to, you know, just eat and not worry about it. And what I like about WW, um, you get a lot, it goes by points and you get a lot of free points, you know, that you can use and things you, things you can eat that don't really cost you. 
and you still have to eat it in moderation but at least you can eat it you know and not feel like oh, I just had this I'm in trouble so you basically it goes by points and you basically if you need to go out or you, you have to plan you have to plan but if you need to go out you can use zero point foods in the morning or all day or whatever and then when you go out you have all your points you can use or you can save your points you know for the weekend if you're a person that likes to go out on the weekend for me I go out um, I try to go out once a month on the weekend and have girls night that's the night I go out and I eat and I don't I try not to worry well I can't have this I can't have that you know I want to go and enjoy myself I don't want to feel like I'm depriving myself of anything so I'm gonna eat when I go out with the girls because that's what it's about it's about going out and enjoying yourself and not have to worry about everyday thing and things like that you enjoy life it, to me that takes away the stress you know and so I try to eat my zero point foods as much you know as I can during the day so I can enjoy it enjoy the night and then what I like about it is you could earn extra points if you exercise so yeah exercising that will um, give you points as well that you can use and that gets added to your weekly so how I, I have my setup where um, my I use my um, fit points first so if I have like um, like my weeklies and I stay within the range that I'm supposed to stay every day my weekly stay and then when I earn fit points those fit points get forwarded to where my weeklies are but I use the fit points first if I need to a lot of times I end up not using my fit points or my weekly it just depends on how you how you're eating and tracking now I was on top of my tracking when I just started this I was like tracking like every day and then all of a sudden like I said I just kind of just slowed down on a lot of things and now I'm slowly I'm back on track you know I'm tracking what I'm eating I'm trying to get a little steps in the job I have is out of desk so it's really hard for me to get those steps in like um, like the way I really want to I know like when I take little vacations here and there I get more steps in than when I'm at work for the whole day I get more steps in half of my day when I'm on vacation than I get for the whole day which is crazy because you think a vacation you're relaxing and you're no usually when I go on a vacation I do a lot of walking um, window shop if I can you know but everything I, I I just feel so much better you know and I think I eat healthier when I'm on vacation which is weird because I do cook when I go out when I go on vacation I cook I get a I get a resort that have a kitchen because I gotta keep you know I, I still gotta eat healthy and I don't plan on spending like arm and a leg just to go out and eat once in a while yes but not every day so I think I do really good um, when I um, when I go out on vacation and things like that but anyway I just thought that um, I could share you know share some of what's going on with me with you guys if you know people some people might have the same struggles I do some people might have um, their struggles might might be worse than mine you know we can help each other let's just put it that way we can help each other and just want to remind you my sister started a jump rope challenge um, Toya's health um, I think it's Toya's health uh, journey she started a jump rope challenge for 21 days today is day number two um please join 
you know, it'll it, it's fun. I do with the with, with my son, and you can do it with your family. She does it with her family, and it's just it's just fun. You're exercising, but it's fun. It's not boring. You know, just just get up. You know, do it. Try it. Don't say you can't do something until you try it. You know. I promise you, it'll be fun. It'll be fun. Just want to thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And um, make sure to turn on your post notifications so you don't miss future videos. Also, subscribe to my channel for G's Kitchen. That's where I'll prepare all my meals and I'll have the recipe. Thank you.